I just want to do a message of encouragement real quick, my brothers and sisters, okay? I want to encourage you. See, when the enemy is trying so hard to stop you from doing something, when it feels like you're being attacked and attacked and attacked, um, how can I put it? Um, and it seems like the enemy may be trying to stop you from doing something. Push forward. Keep going. Okay? Because nine times out of ten, my brothers and sisters, there is a blessing for you on the other side of that thing. Okay? Let me give you an example. Let's say, um, let's say, Oh, oh, let me just maybe pull out one of my stories because um, I have a lot of them. And that's how I could get up here and say this in confidence, my brothers and sisters. OK, so like there was this one time when I was doing music um, and I was supposed to go to a show where there was like this up and coming major artist. OK, he was up and coming, but he was. um major in the cities and, you know, in the surrounding cities, um, from where I am from. Um, but he hadn't not yet just made it to the big leagues, but he was on his way. And so, um, I was supposed to meet this, um, individual this particular night. And I actually did, but let me go through the story. <laughs> so, when I tell you the enemy kept coming at me, coming at trying to do all types of things to make me not be able to make it to this event, um, to be able to meet this person. Um, I mean, it even came down to physical ailments. Um, I don't want to get into too much detail because men and women are on here, <laughs> but you know, um, the, that womanly thing that we get, okay, yeah, well, I don't want to get into too, too much detail, but that that came, and I was all crampy, and um, I mean, it was so bad to the to the point to I could almost not walk, okay, um, and then it seemed like um, I think we ended up uh, that 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 day before we went to that event that night. I think I ended up getting a flat tire on my car. Um, it was just everything that could go wrong. It seemed like it was going wrong. And so I knew I needed to get there to meet this individual because they could change my life in a big way, in a good way. Um, um, however, at some point, I almost got down and laid down and said, you know what? I'm not going. I'm not going. It's just too much going on and I'm not going. But I'm glad that I listened to that little still voice inside of me that said, no, go, go. I don't care what you feel like. I don't care what has happened today. Go. So needless to say, I pushed. I, I pushed. I got myself up. <laughs> I don't care. I was in pain and everything, <laughs> y'all. You know, cramping. Y'all, I pushed and pushed. And I still went to that event. And I'm so glad that I did. Because I was able to meet that particular person and it changed my life for the better. Okay. I was, um, it changed my life for the better. I, um, you know, um, got a boost in the, you know, the music industry and things of that sort from going to that event and meeting that particular person. But the whole time, the enemy was fighting against me, fighting against me, and fighting against me to not get there because he must have had an inkling that I would be blessed, that this would turn out um, good in my favor, in which it did. And so he was fighting against me. And so that's what I'm trying to say because I can't really get it out the way that I want to get it out. So giving that analogy or giving that story, not analogy because it was a true story, um, that tells you what I'm trying to say. So, yes, my brothers and sisters, a lot of times we are going to have to push and push and push even, I mean, through the hurt, through the pain, through the heartache, through the rain. You know what I'm saying? And especially um, when 
it's a possible something that could possibly change your life for the better. Okay. When there is something that could possibly change your life for the better and you keep getting attacked and attacked and attacked, you better know that there's a blessing um, that's going to come to you from that. You just got to get there. You just got to keep going, you know, or whatever it is that you are aiming to do. Keep doing that. Aim to do that. Because there will be a blessing, I can guarantee you, that is going to come out of that thing. But the enemy don't want you to know that. The enemy doesn't want you to get that blessing. So he's going to fight against it. He's going to give you resistance. And so I just want to come in and encourage you all um, to keep going, keep pushing, keep striving, especially when you keep getting all that pushback. Especially. Especially when you keep getting all this, uh, all these blows, boom, 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 keep pushing because I can guarantee you, my brothers and sisters, that there is a blessing on the other side of that thing that the enemy don't want you to have, but you're going to have it because you're going to keep pushing, but you're going to have it. I mean, cause you're going to have it. I'm sorry, y'all. <laughs> um, but yeah, you're going to have it, my brothers and sisters, because you are going to keep going. Sometimes we're going to have to keep going when it, I'm telling you, you might, like I said, even begin to get physical, um, things that happen to your body because the enemy is trying to fight against you so hard, but push anyway, because on the other side of that thing, my brothers and sisters, is something beautiful for you. And the enemy don't want you to know that. But your big sister or little sister fire is here to tell you that the blessing is for you. It's there for you. Just keep on um, persevering, my brothers and sisters. Keep on persevering so that you can get that blessing. So with that being said, this is your sister fire. I love you all, aunt. Until next time. <laughs>